Bonjour. Hello. From our snow-covered national capital and on the traditional territory of the Algonquin people, I salute you. And in their language, Nidana Mikwak, Kakina Anishnabek. The holiday season is a time to reconnect with others, to rejoice, to take a break, at least if you can. But it's also a season to reflect on the months that have passed and to look forward to the new year. Hey, but this is Canada and it's winter. So go out there and enjoy the season. In the past year, I've had the privilege of traveling many places and to meet extraordinary talented people from all walks of life. From a Canadian submarine off Esquimalt, British Columbia, to Baffin Bay near Kikikadua, Nunavut, to Signal Hill overlooking the mighty Atlantic in St. John's, Newfoundland, I have been to every province and every territory, from coast to coast to coast. Throughout the year, we have honored excellence. We walked communities. We've been part of heartfelt conversations at Rideau Hall, at the Citadel, from far and wide. I listened and learned, and I was inspired by what Canadians accomplished for our country and the world, day in and day out. Let me take the opportunity to salute everyone in uniform who serve Canada at home and abroad. Internationally, I visited troops in Ukraine and Latvia, cheered on our athletes at the Pyeongchang Winter Olympics, traveled to the United States, to West Africa, and to Belgium, where we marked the 100th anniversary of the end of the First World War, the war that was supposed to end all wars. Conflict is what happens when we collectively fail, when we fail to work together. On the International Space Station, people of different nationalities and backgrounds work and live together in harmony. It is perhaps what we should replicate here on Earth more often. As the African proverb goes, if we choose to go alone, we might go faster, but when we go together, we go further. Just a few weeks ago, I was in Kazakhstan where I saw Canadian astronaut David Saint-Jacques launch into space. It was incredible. David is making us so proud. And he is no doubt marking New Year's Eve with his fellow astronauts on orbit, but with a win to us Earthlings. Canadians are doing remarkable work everywhere. As Governor General, it has been an honor to show my support, to forge new relationships, to foster collaboration, and to encourage the exploration in new ideas. We should never be afraid of the undiscovered or the uncharted, because curiosity fuels discovery and pushes the frontier of knowledge. Truly, 2018 has been an unforgettable year. We live in a complex, ever-changing world. We share a magnificent planet, our common spaceship, planet Earth. We are privileged to live in this vast, beautiful country, Canada. So let us celebrate our good fortune and remember our shared values of openness and tolerance. In this season, let us reach out to those in need, care for those around us, and let's take time, always, to appreciate our loved ones and our communities, for they are most precious. Happy New Year, Canada. <laughs>